innovative facility is a reflection of our dedication to our employees, our community, and our environment. This center represents a new chapter for Gage. We've transformed this company over the past several years, and this new center allows us to continue to grow and expand our Two individuals demonstrated the highest qualities of leadership during this arduous process, and I would like to recognize them today. Clayton Bushmaker, our Director of Engineering. And Bob Patzel, Director of Laboratories. so pleased to be here. I'm not quite sure what to say because I didn't even take chemistry in high school. <laughs> Does anybody know how this began? Dan. Dan, Dan. How, how, how we, we started out as a distributor. He had the opportunity. <laughs> <laughs> Gage is 79 years old and going to be turning 80 next year. And uh, it started out as a distributor to the automotive industry, distributing uh, oil for um, Shell. Shell. Shell was the, we were the first distributor for Shell in 1936. And then we started right here on Wanda in Ferndale at 625, which is two blocks south of here. And then how did it happen? We must have profited and uh, <laughs> uh, because our, our product goes out clear, clean, uh, uh, a virgin solvent like this, I guess would be a good way to look at it. This shows remanufactured. But uh, the virgin would look the same way. You need to see that mm -hmm. it's... Yeah. Mm -hmm. So this is the way the product starts out as a virgin and the way it's sent back as a remanufactured product. What happens is we'll take and get product back from uh, the paint factory after the paint solids have been uh, absorbed into the uh, mixture and it, it comes back looking like this. This purplish color is, is, is consistently purple. We get all the different colors coming together to make it look purple. Now what we do with that is we send it through a system which pulls out the, the paint solids. What you have in here is just the solids themselves with a small amount of uh, purge in there. And uh, that's pulled out then it's sent through a distillation column and uh, sent back, after it's reconstituted, sent back to the, the factory to be reused again. Mm -hmm. Now this purge is used where in the process of uh, producing a car? It's used in the, 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 paint, the painting of the car to clean the paint lines. So if you ever look at like those pages in cranes where you have uh, all the different companies that have products on the car, ours isn't there because our product is used during the process of painting, but it doesn't remain. There's nothing. Ours gets sent back here and we reuse it again. Mm -hmm. the, uh, the process uh, is very quick, obviously, and uh, it really it developed because... Uh, uh, the, the way uh, the process of producing cars has changed over the years. They're not painting all black cars in one day, is that correct? That's correct, it, and you're right. They, well, they used to, if they were going to paint a color, they, they would paint at least a half a day all the same color. That was a, the old way of doing it. Today, mm -hmm. you might have three white cars, and then a color change to red, two red cars, five blue cars, four black. It all depends on how the dealerships are ordering the, the cars based on sales that are going on. And your purge, your, your, your solvent, quickly cleans the line to, to, uh, to produce the, uh, the next color. 
Yeah, the the process is uh, requiring a quicker and quicker cleaning. Right now, today, we can do it in about five seconds, do a color change from, you know, one color to the next using our product to clean the lines out. Mm -hmm. That's amazing. The, the advantage you have uh, over, let's say, a... Uh, uh, a paint company doing this is the fact that you're you're recycling the product, and uh, there's some environmental issues here that you have uh, created over the years and helped. Well, we began recycling in 1987, and that was a new a new era for Gage. From that point on, we've been very environmentally conscious, and I we really dr drive our business based on that. Um, I'm sure the paint companies do exactly the same thing, but if you look at paint versus purge, purge is a very, uh, actually a, an insignificant amount of money in comparison to paint. Um, I, I think uh, our, our business thrives because of our technology, our scientists, our unique way of uh, processing, and the fact that we actually keep a closed loop. There's a lot of details that um, are involved in doing that that um, I, I don't know that the larger companies would be that much interested in, mm -hmm. in, getting, in, in getting deep into it the way we do. But you do satisfy a very uh, key uh, aspect uh, uh, to uh, help uh, protect the environment here by recycling. Uh, that that is an advantage that uh, you bring to the process. Yes, if you if you look at what we currently do, we're able. In, you know, it used to be just send virgin product. Um, today, seventy percent of the product we send out comes back, gets reused, and goes back. So you you may have product that's that's painted many many cars over over years that is still in use because we're able to uh, remanufacture. And what's the significance of uh, today's ribbon cutting? We, we have a, a significant milestone today in the opening of the Gage Innovation Center. It's a, a new laboratory facility that brings our R&D and our quality control laboratories within the same building. They're still separate spaces, but the equipment can now be utilized by both groups to uh, more efficiently handle the demands of our customers. Mm -hmm. And uh, you, you must be very proud to uh, uh, be in charge of an organization uh, that's been around for three generations. That's almost unheard of today. Uh, it's, it has an amazing history, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. It, yeah, absolutely. It's uh, you know, it's a family. I'm part of the family. I'm married to one of the uh, the third generation owners, and uh, it's you know the the family really cares about the community, and they've they've uh, continuously looked at you know the employees here are important, and uh, you know profitability is important. Don't get me wrong, but um, long term. Uh, uh, growth of the company, I think, uh, has been our consistent uh, goal. One, two, two, two three. three.